Hello everyone, so today we're going to be looking at a 16-bit ALU. So shown here we have four 74-181 uh, IC chips, which each chip is responsible for four bits worth of data. And on the right side over here we have a 74-182. And we have our F bus here which collects all of our output data from each uh, 74-181. So each chip outputs four bits worth of data. We have our A bus and our B bus, which is what we use to do uh, our operations on either arithmetic or logic functions. Our M is a selection between logic functions or arithmetic functions. And then we have the S bus up here, which is our selection, which tells each chip what exactly we're doing. Um, so if I were to run this, for example, oh, and then we also have our C stem over here which is our carry in or carry is our selection between either having a one as a carry in or a zero as a carry in bring up the display and if you see here we have eight and five on our we have eight on our b bus a five on our a bus and if you notice our output which is f is d so that's doing eight plus five which is d these numbers are all shown in hex and if we wanted to change the arithmetic function that these chips are performing we can simply look up this table here and we have our selection mode which is our S bus here and then our, you see our M here which high when it's high it's logic functions when it's low and our carry in is also set to high we're doing arithmetic functions so right now we're in this column with the way we have it set up so we're doing this function right now so say we wanted to change that function to do A minus 1 so that would take the data on the A bus and subtract 1 so that's all high on the S bus over the S bus and we change our data here to be all high we run it again go to our output visualize it and if you notice here we took we ignored our B bus entirely we took our A bus which was 5 and we subtracted 1 which is 4 um, this was a very short run through of a 16-bit ALU in ORCAD capture thank you